Okay, we now have our project loaded and the Click CPU is in the run mode. Let's now see what we can do to test our ladder logic using one of the many features available in the programming software. Data View is the built-in software feature we can use to test our ladder logic program. The Data View dialog box can be accessed as shown here. From the navigation window on the left side of the software development screen, select the Program tab, open the Data View folder under Monitor, and double click on Data View 1. Or we can also go to the Monitor pull down menu at the top of the screen. Click on Data View and select Data View 1 as shown here. As always, there are multiple ways to access the different features within the Click Programming software. There is also an Add New Data View icon on the toolbar that allows us to name a Data View dialog box as demonstrated here. For reference, this means we can have multiple Data Views open to assist in developing and debugging our project. The data views can be assigned unique names and saved with our project for future use. Once we have our data view one dialog box opened, as shown here, we need to add the addresses of the data types we want to monitor. Select the edit button in the upper left corner of the data view and type address C1 into address position number 001 as shown here. It is always a good idea to have the status monitor turned on to allow seeing the discrete states and numeric values of our program's bits and data registers. The quickest way to do this is to click on the status monitor icon as shown here. Okay, we are finally ready to test. We need to override the current value of our internal C1 bit. We can do this by double-clicking the ON button in the New Value column of our C1 entry in Data View as shown here. The C1 bit will change from OFF to ON. The C1 bit being ON will then enable Timer T1. Timer T1 starts timing. After our timer preset of 5 seconds has elapsed, Output Y001 will turn on as indicated here by the output coil highlighted in blue. Finally, take a look at the last video in this series, Step 10, to see the results. Until next time, thank you for watching and have a great day.